prescribe, but then there is a list of diseases where you can write prescriptions. Now this is probably in the future. This is how it is going to be. Because the genetic population is going to increase more and more. And we will need more and more people who can write prescriptions. The doctors will not be so many and doctors cannot remember all this. So my dear friends, this is an extremely interesting field, a very expanding field, a very futuristic field you belong to. And I think you have to take it seriously. The important part is innovation as it has it was really imposed upon so much. In India we don't do innovations, we don't invent things. The reason being we don't think freely. We have a rota system. We are in a gut. We are not given you know free mind. We cannot we are not supposed to think. I know during my training, whenever I try to say something, my professor will say, shut up. Who is the professor here? Keep quiet. Where I join philosophy here is that there is a child in everybody and let the child find. What happens? That kotuhal jota hai, kotuhal. That inquisitiveness we never let flourish, even in our students, in ourselves also. And we try to become, either when we become professor, we think very serious. And when they are young, we don't let them think that you are too small to think. And probably I think we have to break this barrier and these shackles have to be broken. And we have given an example. How anybody, how Wright brothers thought of making an aircraft? Look, it was a wild thought at that time that how can a man fly? It was a wild thought. But they persisted with their childish imagination. And it was a childish imagination, foolish at that time. So until as we think childish, until as we keep the child within us thriving, alive, we cannot create new things. The brown brain cannot create new things. It has to be white. It has to be childish. Your brain may be mature, but let your heart be young. So you think young, think fresh. Until as you think that you can do it, you cannot do it. You have to do, you have to believe first you can do it, and then only you will do it. So the pharmacy, colleges, and the students have to think in that way that they have to create new atmosphere, a new field they have to break. It's not easy to break a field because there is always a competition. The medical field will always think they are going to, you know, encroach on our field. They are, if they will start prescribing, they become our competitor. So obviously you have to break your own new field, you have to develop your skills, and you have to be innovative, you have to do inventions, you have to have new ideas, until you, do, you don't have, you do have these, it will be very difficult for you to really break any new field in this difficult world, which is very, very competitive. Pharmacy, as well as I was going through it, you see, it's going through significant changes. Now we are talking about personal pills, where every individual will have a personal pill for his disease. We can get it to that level. We are going to cellular level. We are going to genomics now. We are going to biological engineering and biological chemistry here. So this, this is vast expanding and it is breaking the, all the barriers of a typical or sort of pharma, pharmaceutical training or pharmacology. It is expanding and going into isolation drugs and then you leave them in the body, release them in the body. So the field is beyond imagination. So this is what I want to say. There is a big scope for a cooperation, for an alliance. It is natural actually. We should not have this upmanship. I am bigger, he is lesser, he is attendant to me and he, 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 I am the main. You see when it comes to war, everybody has to fight. It's a war we are waging against either attack, against the human diseases, and we all have to fight this war as a team, as a group, and that's extremely important. So I think uh, I would not like to really take long time, but there are few things I would like to say that somehow the pharmacy field is exciting in one way that it can be right from an academic field to basic research field to an industrial field. When a pharmacist opens a company, he becomes industrious. So, the ramifications are very wide and empty. The nexus between a doctor and a pharmaceutical company, we all know that, what is happening. We have to break that. A lot of dishonesty has come into it, a lot of money has come into it, 
lot of wrong things have come into it. So we have to Hello. see as a future pharmacist to the world, to the humanity at large. So we have to have some sort of honesty. Without that, it's very difficult. And we should think that how we can make this place a better place. As a father, so as a Sardar, I think that the Ishwar is going to give me the power 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 to सोशन से झुक गई कमरिया जीनी हो गई जगत चदरिया और प्रभु मुझ पर कृपा बरसा दे निपुण जुलाहा मुझे बना दे इस सर्जन को सृजक बना दे मुझको कुछ धागे दिलवा दे गाड़ी गुंडों फिर में चदरिया जीनी हो गई जगत चदरिया और इस चादर को नए नए रंगों से भर दूं नए नए रंगों से भर दूं विषमताओं को मैं कम कर दूं विषमताएं ऊंच नीच चार पांच विषमताओं को मैं कम कर दूं तब तो दोपहरी छांव जो कर दे बन जाऊं मैं ऐसी बदरिया फिर अंधकार में दम की बिजुलिया झीनी हो गई जगत चतरिया प्रभु मुझ पर कृपा बरसा दे निपुण जिला हा मुझे बना दे बना दे मुझको कुछ धागे दिलवा दे और इन धागों से वस्त्र बना दूं इन धागों से वस्त्र बना दूं परिधानों के ढेर लगा दूं भूखे नंगों को ढकवा दूं मृत चेहरों पर हंसी सजा दूं फिर सब ओढ़ है जगत चदरिया फिर से उठे स्वर लहरिया प्रभु मुझ पर कृपा बरसा दे मुझको कुछ आगे दिलवा दे तो कनेक्टिविटी विद द सोसाइटी इज एक्सट्रीमली इंपॉर्टेंट इन व्हाट एवर प्रोफेशन वी आर आई कैन नॉट थिंक आई एम जस्ट अ न्यूरो सर्जन एंड माय जॉब इज टू जस्ट टू ओपन द स्कल एंड बैक बोन एंड यू नो Take my money and go home and enjoy. Well, yes, that is to be done. Why not? Enjoy life. We all are here to enjoy life. But a fruitful life. An honest life, we are answerable to ourselves. Otherwise, there is somebody there. You may believe, you may not believe. It's your destiny, nature, whatever. It takes care of all this. Because there is somebody who controls us. We all are like kites. हम सब पतंग के समान हैं कोई काला कोई भूरा कोई गोरा सब अलग-अलग रंगों की पतंगें हैं और ये जो संसार है ये ये जो आकाश है ये संसार सरीखा है कि नब है ये संसार ये काया पतंग है मोरी और प्रभु उड़ाता हमें हाथ में उसके डोरी और भांति भांति की पतंग बनाता भांति भांति की पतंग बनाता तरह-तरह के रंग लगाता अलग-अलग सा उन्हें सजाता कुछ भूरी पीली होती है कुछ काली कुछ गोरी प्रभु उड़ाता हमें हाथ में उसके डोरी और कभी चढ़ाए सीधी कभी उतर लहराता उसके ऊपर है कि कहां आपको धक्के खिलाए और कहां सूझे ऊपर ले जाए कभी चढ़ाए सीधा कभी उतर लहराता ले जाए सर्वोच्च कभी फिर नीचे लाता पाप पुण्य और सही गलत के पेंच लड़ाता जो दुष्कर्मों से प्रेरित उनको काट गिराता मानव तेरे कर्म लिखते नियति तोरी प्रभु उड़ाता हमें हाथ में उसके जो नाउ इट इज काइस हाउ वी आर गोइंग टू प्रोग्रेस यू सी आई नो आई हैव स्ट्रे बट आई लाइक स्ट्रेन अंटिल अस यू स्ट्रे यू कैन नॉट फाइंड अ न्यू पाथ ब्रेक द बैरियर्स डोंट बी स्टिल जैकेटेड थिंक डिफरेंट इट्स एक्सट्रीमली इंपॉर्टेंट अदरवाइज आई जस्ट रिमेन अ वेरी बोरिंग ग्रे न्यूरो सेल इफ आई डोंट स्ट्रे आई लाइक स्ट्रेन That's why you find new areas and new vistas and go in the wilderness. Why not? The only type and the only one who is looking at you is what happens. But this is a fact. We cannot deny that. Sat karmo ki hawa hai banti, jitti banti, utti banti. Sat karmo ki hawa hai banti, jitti banti, utti banti. Paap punya ki karle ginti, nahi prayapt hai keval din si. Tum tu ni ilane se bhagwan kusam nahi. की कर ले गिनती नहीं पर्याप्त है केवल गिनती इस परम शक्ति को समझ बावरे ये नहीं कल्पना कोरी प्रभु उड़ाता हमें हाथ में उसके डोरे बट व्हाट हैपेंस एक्चुअली यू नो व्हाट हैपेंस वी डू टोटली डिफरेंट थिंग्स 
When we come to life, we are like a tabula rasa, like a white plain paper, nothing written on it. That's not less thread, not a single one. Plain. Tu usse sulji door hai paata. Tu usse sulji door hai paata, par hawa virudh phir pata nun aata. Aur usse taangne ke hat mein se dori ko uljhata jata. Jeevan chalne te saral maal par matkar jabra jori. Prabhu uraata hume aat mein uske dori. So, Pitro, as I have, we are answerable to our own problems and we create our own problems. That is extremely important. It, it's a demi philosophical lecture for me and that's why I thought I'll stray. One more po poem and last before anybody tries to commit suicide because of my poetry. <laughs> <laughs> because, you see, that's the problem with poetry. You give him a mic and then he becomes a demon. <laughs> Why? But all this, this thing. One poem is equivalent to 10 hours of lecture. This is my belief. Because I can bore you. But I don't want to. I want it to be more summarous, you know. Little bit surila, thoda sa, aapko achcha lagi ka. Or samaj bhi jayaan baat. Ek jo akhri, mein baat bolna jaunga. Ki, jeevan mein kabhi bhi, jo vekti, जमीन से जुड़ के चलेगा वो कभी खत्म नहीं होगा ये सच्चाई है जीवन की कितना भी बड़ा व्यक्ति हो जब तक वो जमीन से जुड़ के नहीं चलेगा वो कहीं ना कहीं मार खाएगा और उसका बहुत बड़ा उदाहरण है घास कि मेरी कविता मुझे बहुत अच्छी लगती है घास ऐसी चीज है इंडस्ट्रक्टेबल है जमीन से जुड़ के चलती है कैसे ये कविता में आपको समझेगा तो घास बनना है मेरा कहने का मतलब ये है कहीं भी पहुंचो लेकिन घास बन गया वो आपको अमृत तो देगी लगभग कि दरख्त यानी कि पेड़ दरख्त और बेलों को दहकते देखा और तमाम जंगल को शोलों में बदलते देखा मिला जो राह में तू उसको लील जाएगा दावा नल है तू यानी कि जंगल की आग दावा नल दावा नल है तू पर घास में तू मिटाना पाएगा जंगल की आग में पूरा जंगल खाए बदल जाता है लेकिन घास पहली बरसात में फिर हरी हो जाती है पर घास तू मिटा ना पाएगा विशाल वट वृक्षों को तिनकों सा उड़ाया तूने और आबाद बस्तियों को वीराना बनाया तूने तेरा गुस्सा ये जंगल तबाह कर जाएगा तूफान है तू पर घास में तू मिटा ना पाएगा नेक्स्ट दृश्य है कि तेरे मंजर से यानी कि तुझे देखकर तेरे मंजर से दिल सबका दहलता होगा और बाहर जंगल को तू खाक में बदलता होगा मिट्टी खाक बाहर जंगल को तू खाक में बदलता होगा उगूंगा खाक पे घास फिर से मिट्टी हो जाती है उगूंगा खाक पे मेरा तन फिर से लहलाएगा सैलाब है तू बाढ़ सैलाब है तू पर घास में तू मिटा ना पाएगा आखिरी चार लाइने हैं कि वहशिय छोड़ तू हिंसा बनकर तो देख और यो प्यार में पैरों से कुचल कर भी देख पर मिटूंगा खुद ही ये तुझसे किया न जाएगा मिटूंगा खुद ही ये तुझसे किया न जाएगा बड़ा जालिम है तू पर घास में तू मिटा न पाएगा आई विश ऑल ऑफ यू अ ग्रेट सक्सेस आई नो योर प्रोफेशन एज अ ग्रेट फ्यूचर I like it or I don't like it doesn't matter as a doctor. <laughs> so have your own courage. So abhimani baniye. Lekin apne aap ko paripak ko kijiye, apne aap ko achhi se se train kijiye. Ad kachara mal jahan bhi jayega, fail ho gaya hai. So this is the time you should train, and this is the time you should really give full attention to your profession. Please study hard, think different. That's the key word thinks different thinks freely it may sound illogical it may sound bewildering it may sound horrendous doesn't matter think different so that's the word i would like to say thank you very much really you are the savior for the n number of the patients of the nagpur and the nearby nagpur you are just like the god to the patients 
and bring you as a God or the Savior to the one who is at the destiny of death. And you are having a number of the blessings. Why not be with the Kavita? You are most of the time, I think, right from morning till the late in the evening, you are there in the operation theaters. And how you, being a bureau of service, once again, from me, Nakroid and the ph pharmacists, we salute your contribution to the neurology. Thank you, sir. Thank you. I request uh, the degree, sir, to please uh, felicitate Dr. Lokendra Singh by presenting Memento. Degree, sir, please. My colleague teachers and student friends from the United Pharmacy Medical <coughs> Approach. He has led us to United Pharmacy Medical Association. <laughs> really, there is nothing much more, even to add a word, single word. The way he has treated us, I don't feel that there can be any question left, but it is open. Please. <laughs> 